Hi guys, welcome to the Forge Ahead podcast. I want to spend some time this week talking about a man's prayer life with a specific component of that of praying for and with your wife. In Ephesians 5, the Apostle Paul says, Husbands, love your wives as Christ loved the church and gave himself up for her that he might sanctify her. You see, we as husbands have a role in helping our wives be sanctified, which means to become more like Christ. In our salvation journey, we're justified when we're saved from our sin. We're sanctified, which means growing to be more like Christ in our lives, and then we're glorified when we leave this earth into His presence. So you have a very important role to play in your wife's sanctification or becoming more like Jesus each and every day. And a great place to start, a very simple way you can help her in that process is by praying for and with your wife. And I will tell you now, you cannot know how much security and trust and fulfillment will come in your marriage relationship when you regularly and consistently pray for and with your wife. It's one of these things that I can't just tell you about the experience. You can only know it when you actually do it. And look, don't overcomplicate this. I guarantee you this, if you ask your wife today, honey, what can I pray about for you? She will have something. She will give you a topic or a request that she has. If not, you contact me because she will be the first wife that I've met in 25 years of ministry that doesn't have a way that she would like her husband to pray for her. And if you want to take it up a notch, subscribe to a devotional. It'll come to your email. You guys read it, talk about it, and use the prayer guide that's there. There are so many ways that you can begin this very simple practice of praying for and with your wife. Two things on it, two very important things. First, have a plan and be consistent. But look, if you miss a day, don't beat yourself up. Don't give up. Everything in life that's worthwhile takes time, effort, and some consistency. And the last thing is this, it may be awkward. It's a little bit uncomfortable, I get that. I've had men tell me, well, I just have a hard time praying out loud with my wife. And so I ask them, do you pray silently? And they say, oh yeah. Well, here's the key, just add air. If you can pray silently, you can pray out loud. All you do is move air over your vocal cords and say out loud what you're thinking. It may be awkward, it may be uncomfortable, but guys, get over yourself. Lead your wife, pray for her, build her up and help sanctify her in her walk with Christ by praying for her and with her. You will be amazed at the benefit it will bring to your marriage relationship.